Merc is live, I can finally do my homework. Correct. In fact, I want to Pavlov you so that you become more productive when you're watching me. I'd love to Pavlov us both. Honestly, that's the main goal. Ambiguous Tom, thank you for the 31 months! Holy shit, 31! 31 months. Yippee indeed, thank you so much. I appreciate you being here. Hi, how are you doing? How is everyone? Sorry, I uh, uh, was not streaming uh, most of this week. I got real, real sick. Sick in the face, <laughs> which you could probably still hear, and a little bit sick in the brain. Um, but I'm here to hang out, I'm here to chat. How you doing? I'm doing great, I'm doing really well. How are you all? Who, someone was first at Ozzy and Shadow. Congratulations. It was not our usual Tom and Lorraine race this morning, although Worm was second, very quick in second place. Ozzy and Shadow, congratulations. You have won the award for first chatter today. I'm gonna start giving this out. How does that sound, chat? Ozzy and Shadow, congratulations. This award is yours today. Da -da -da -da. First chatter wins the award, and you keep the award until someone else steals it from you. I'm clinging to life with the cold to end all colds. God, I'm so sorry. I Has anyone else noticed that Adam from Has Been is Beetlejuice? I will let you know. I called that immediately. One thing about me, chat, one thing that I'm really proud of, one thing that I will love forever, which, by the way, if you don't have, like, at least one or two things that you love about yourself, you do. You just don't know them. You just don't have them at the top of your head, okay? Everyone has certain things about themselves that they actually do really like, but I think the majority of people don't pay attention to them. The more, majority of people don't think about the good things about themselves because they're so trained by everything around them to think about the bad things, okay? So here's a little reminder for you. Think about something about yourself that you like, that you like. You don't even have to like love it, but something you like. Hi, Yana, I hope you're doing so, so well. Something that I like about myself is my ability when I'm watching media to go, oh, I know that person and to be able to figure out where I know them from. I have like a, a mental IMDB list in my brain. And so if I see somebody in a show or if I hear their voice, I can very quickly usually um, pinpoint, do I have my water up here? I do. I can usually pinpoint where it is that I know them from. Uh, and so I did that with Has Been Hotel and I'm very proud of that. I, I love that about myself. I do, truly. So uh, yeah, and let's start that out. Let's start today with that, okay? A nice chill Saturday. What's something that you like about yourself? If you genuinely can't think of anything, just take your time today. By the end of the day, by the time you're going to sleep, see if there's something that you can that you could choose. Not even something you love, necessarily. Just something you're like, oh yeah. I am so, so good. Good, Yana, I haven't seen you guys in a minute. Um, but yeah, this week, I started a new medication, so I, I don't remember if I fully told you guys. I got diagnosed, like, officially with OCD 
a month or two ago, um, which is something I've definitely had forever, but I didn't realize was a diagnosable issue that was different than the normal brain until very recently. Um, and it wasn't until finding out that I'm autistic and doing a lot of research beyond that, that I was able to separate other things and be like, oh, this is, this is an issue that I have. Um, and OCD is honestly probably my biggest mental block out of anything that I have where it just gets in the way of a lot of things. So, um, I've been trying a new medication to see if it would help with my OCD, but with, if you guys have ever taken like antidepressants or like, you know, SSRIs, those types of things, um, they can work or they can do very the opposite direction, right? They can make you feel worse. And so in my case, I started a new medication a couple of weeks ago and it hit me and started like working, um, I think earlier last week, like mid last week. And it ended up just making me not feel good. Like it, it made me feel worse. So I've been kind of in this weird chemical depression where like, I know that I'm fine, but my brain has not been in a good spot. So I stopped taking my meds a while ago. I I've talked to my doctor and whatnot, I'm swapping over. So I've just kind of not really been here. And then on top of that, cold end all colds, I fucking get you cause I'm, I get barely breathe, but that's nothing new. God, that's nothing new. So uh, OCD is wretched. I'm glad you're on the path to managing it. Yes, it is, it is very frustrating. Like of all of the things that I have to deal with, it's the one that I'm like, <laughs> That and my fucking chronic illness. If someone could figure out how to personify the thing that makes my body so fucking exhausted, I will beat the shit out of it. So serious. Uh, that good, good old patterns and rituals OCD. Yeah, um, I definitely recommend if you if you've never really thought about it, but you have a lot of mental blocks, I would look into the symptoms of it because it's important to be aware of. Like my dad has OCD, and uh, I yeah. I definitely thought that I was normal because my dad did all of these things. And so I was like, well, if my dad doesn't, then I'm fine, right? And a lot of people, especially when your parents are neurodivergent, but they're not diagnosed, you don't get diagnosed because you're like, well, yeah, that's how people act because that's how you were raised. It's always important. It's always important. Understanding yourself will never be a bad thing. Never, ever, ever. Although sometimes it is a lot of wisdom to, to be handling. And you're like, oh my God. Anyway. Good morning. Tom, I think I saw Tom in chat. Good morning. It's not necessarily morning, but I took a nap today. I've been very tired. I can do basically any accent. Wait, that's so sick. Hold on. Because you're not... Oh, you can just do any accent that you're not native to. That's kind of pretty sick, I'm going to be honest. I didn't get diagnosed until my doctor was like, no, that's... That's not quirky. Well, chat, we're in our first ad break. We're hanging out. And I, I know we're not in inscription anymore, but I'm going to be honest. I've been really enjoying the riddles. I've just been, I've been liking them. So I say, let's keep going with the riddles. If you guys don't mind, I would like to keep going with the riddles. We've got a new funky little background song going today. Easy first one. I'll give it to you, Tom. B is your answer. I accept it. Okay, good job, good job, woohoo, confetti time. Listen, we're onto the real ones now. I've mixed in a couple riddles today. Again, I try to give a collection of good, like easy ones and not so easy ones, but I'm interested to see how you do with this one today. Our first riddle, I fly without wings, I cry without eyes. Wherever I go, darkness follows me. Give me a good old guess, chat. I tried to give you the, the best warm up riddle first. Hmm? Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Maybe someone will get a Merc coin today. Who knows? We still don't know what those do. That's, this is a danger zone. I shouldn't keep mentioning my own Merc coin that I don't have an answer for. Does no one know? Is everyone really, really considering and thinking right now? I'm really surprised. A shadow? Okay, great guess. I appreciate Mint Choco Cheat taking a guess. Close. Not quite. Chat, if we don't know, I'm gonna come back to it. You guys can take your time. Hey, if anyone thinks of it, I'll, I'll give it to you. I'm impressed. I, t I tried to get some more difficult ones today because I felt like we had, we had too many easy ones. So I'm actually really, really happy that no one gets that immediately. It means I'm doing my job right. I've been searching. You did have a big brain guess and I'm proud of you. I'm, I'm not going to say what the answer is because <coughs> I'll give us time. I'm not native English. Oh, so you become Scottish when you, I see, I see, I see. 
Hi, Mark. I haven't been able to catch a stream in literally so long. Yo, hi, Riverwater. I hope you're doing so well. I think my sound is down on this game. Yeah, there we go. Hi, we're back in Dredge. Hi, Riverwater. Perfect time for you because we're in the water today. Uh... Ba -ba 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 -ba. I've been lurking for a bit. Gotta write an email. No worries. Sounds good. Also been drinking since 2 p.m. That sounds real fun right now. That sounds like a, a jammy time. Hold on. If you're shitting me and it's clouds, <laughs> I'll riot. Why would I be shitting you? Listen, that's fine. That that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> Listen, I don't, don't talk to me. Talk to your D and D campaign. I don't know your. I don't know. Banned from your own chat. Can that happen? Hi, Tom. Thank you for the thirty stream streak. Holy shit! Can you imagine if I streamed once a month? Or no? Well, that's basically what it is. Once a day, you'd get a thirty stream streak in a month. It doesn't make sense. I think it does. A cloud. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all, I would support this. Banning me from my own chat? I think it makes sense. They don't cry. Rain is not tears. I guess. Is that really what you're upset about? Because that I guessed a cloud when I read that. Just saying, I got it pretty easily. Oh, the daily streams. Good, okay, maybe daily streams. I was planning on doing that this week and then it didn't work. Anyway, listen, hey, hey, my mod is yelling at me. You might, if you're joining right now and you're like, what the fuck's going on? This is completely normal, okay? My mods are yelling at me. I am I am not on task, okay? We've been here for 10 minutes and what are we doing right now? Welcome to Dredge. Welcome to an RIP Mercury stream. Hi, hello, we solve riddles here. Hi, Merkin Chat. Hi, Overwatch fanboy. I am allowed to yell. You're allowed. Get your feelings out. Get them out there. Also, audio check. Is this okay? Is it too loud? I'm gonna... I'm gonna say it's probably good. What else can be rain since there's no good answers? Right? What What else do you call rain? What else do you explain rain? All right. Mr. Trader, sir, I sold you everything I have. I've got a little tooth squid. Chat, I want the pirate flag back. Uh, I want to change my flag to the pirate flag anchor flag fish flag no it's the pirate flag there we go i want the pirate flag because we are pirateering today listen you remember this motherfucker this this the pirate map that we found last time i need to solve this quest i need to solve it and i am not giving up until we do so let's go give those Squiddy guys over where we need to get them so that they don't turn into rot in my oh Yeah, we'll do that last next time. Well, I'm not a fisherman today. I am but a pirate I did my nails ten minutes before stream started and they're TARDIS blue chat should I paint my nails? I have not been painting my nails for about two years almost three because I worked at Starbucks for a really long time And you couldn't have your nails painted if you worked at Starbucks but now I can. Now I'm free. So honestly, I really should. And uh, I just haven't yet. Okay, I'm gonna sell... Oh, just these two fish? Damn, $40? Take that, motherfucker. Okay, I don't have anything else. Nope. Okay, here's the thing, chat. On my map... Okay, here's, here's the other map. The real map. The treasure map. Here's the treasure map. We were looking for this weird bone-shaped island, okay? We found this thing over by, correct me if I'm wrong, one of them was at the lava place up here, unless I'm crazy. One of, no, I don't think it was. I think that the rest of them were down here, right? So I, if I remember correctly, cause I was uploading my VODs the other day, I'm pretty sure we found the last piece like right over here. Give the relic to the collector. See, the thing is the collector seems a little shady. I don't know if I trust him. I'm kind of holding off on that. I'm a little worried about giving the relic to the collector. Oh wait, is this, uh, is this a dick shaped island? Is this the bone? Wait, it's got the little, it's got the little thingy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. It's got the thing. Yo, 
Yo! 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 Hold on! So, this, this in stellar. Okay, I'm gonna place this here. The st in stellar. I think that is where we're supposed to be going, chat. It is time to pirateer. Richard Island? Uh, I don't know if I want to bring this along. I'm worried we're gonna... Okay, you know what? I'll bring it. I'll bring it. Just for the sake of it. Richard Island? Oh, yes. Sorry. I, I spoke by his informal name, and that was incorrect of me. I apologize, chat. We don't know Richard like that. We don't know Richard Island like that. Hey, water. Drink some water. I'm still extremely dehydrated, chat. I think I do have a cold. Um, however, Happy Lunar New Year today. Happy Lunar New Year. Can we get some little explosions? Do we have any party hats? I think party hats would be fun. Whoa, look how fast the moon's moving. Look, I'm playing peekaboo with the moon. It only moves when I move. Woo! Woo! If I go backwards, it will still move forwards. Unfortunately, I can't reverse time. <laughs> but I can't chase the moon, chat. I am damned to never chase the moon. Let's see. Yo, Overwatch fanboy, congrats on your seven stream streak. Chad, I think I'm going to be streaming back tomorrow. Okay, yeah, this is where we found the last thing, right? I'm not crazy. Also, Chad, I think we only need like two more research parts. And then we're basically set on... I don't have room for this. I don't have room for this. I can't. Two more research parts and then we get our abyssal hadal ocean thing. I think, and we'll finally be able to have uh, all of the things that we want, all of the different fishing lines. So far, we've had to compromise every single time for something. Or is this where we found it? This might be where we found the pirate ship. It might be this one. Okay, so let me look again. I think it will be this one, either this one or this one. I guess we'll see. Let's, let's go see, chat. There we go, we got some party hats. Happy Lunar New Year. If you felt like the new year happened and you were like, God, I still feel like I'm rotting, it's cause you are. Not to get all crazy and conspiratorial on you, but this is absolutely true. Um, the calendar that we use was created by humans. It is not accurate to the actual, like, year structure of our Earth. So the Lunar New Year is a much more accurate representation of when the new year would be than in the middle of January. Honestly, January makes no fucking sense. We're in the middle of winter. New Year starts during spring. Anyone knows that. So, uh, yeah, if you've been rotting up until this point, like I have, I've been absolutely, positively, fundamentally rotting, um, then uh, now is actually springtime. All of those New Year's resolutions that you're like, damn, I failed. There's a skinny brown dog leaping in the shadows. Occasionally it lunges at the water, snapping at some small silvery fish. Its technique is ineffective. Give it to me! You jump off the boat into thigh-high water. The dog stops chasing fish and focuses on you. I'm gonna slowly approach. Hi. Hello. You wade towards the shore. As you get nearer, the dog backs up a little ways. It sits. Can I throw some fish towards the dog? You throw some scraps towards the dog, which land in the sand. The dog eats them, along with a mouthful of sand. Oh, well that's not great. Uh, call for the dog. You make soft, encouraging noises, and the dog cautiously approaches. It stops just out of your reach. Slowly approach. You move closer to the dog. It seems startled and runs back up the shoreline. Call for the dog. You call out to the dog softly, but it doesn't seem to want to come any closer. Fuck. Hold some fish in your hand. That's what I should have done. You hold out some fish scraps in the palm of your hand. The dog approaches slowly, but soon begins licking at them. Pat the dog. You reach out and gently pat the dog. Its eyes follow your hand and seems to understand you're not a threat. You pat the dog again. It seems to be enjoying it. Can I take it? I can't take the dog? Are you kidding me? I can't take the dog? You make your way back towards the boat. As you're wading out, you hear the sloshing of four legs cutting through the water. You stop and turn around. The dog is standing a few paces behind you. It tilts its head questioningly. Let it follow me. You continue, this time with the dog alongside. Its tail is wagging so hard it beats the water into a froth behind it. I'm gonna cry. When you get to the boat, you turn around and pull the dog on board. You lift 
the dog onto the deck. It walks around briefly before curling into a ball and looking up at you. Maybe you could find this dog a more permanent home. What if I want- okay. Immediately. Immediately, right? I want it, but I know we would kill it. Yeah, we'd lose the dog. Someone's immediately- someone's already yelling at me in chat to not lose the dog, so we know I would lose the dog. But you know what? We're gonna make this dog a fucking pirate, because- holy shit, I forgot this was here. We're gonna make this dog a fucking pirate. Are you ready? Uh, he's about to have the best time ever. And then we'll find him a permanent home. Uh, maybe I could put him with the dock worker? I don't know. Where- who wants a dog? The laboratory lady? I don't really trust her. I feel like that's a bad idea. I feel like she'd fuck with him. Shove it in a locker! Don't throw it off the boat. Okay, I'm gonna be very careful. Oh, it's vision time. Well, I wasn't prepared for this, but I guess it's vision time. Okay. Uh, let me just, uh, shove my- Yo! No! Oh, that's not what I fucking need right now! Okay, the dog's okay. The dog's fine. But I'm in danger. We're so dangerous right now. Okay, so either the treasures- I'm not going out there in the middle of the night in the open water. Are you insane? Are you insane? Are you insane? No! Are you insane? I'm not- I have a dog! I'm, I'm not- Okay, where am I? Starlight pontoon- there you are. Hey! Hey! Hello! I'm gonna sleep. Do you want a dog? I kind of want this dog, but I'm not a good owner for this dog. I should not have any living thing. I have learned I cannot do that. Um, I don't, I'll buy all sorts of fish here. You want the... Okay, no, you don't want the... I can't put you in storage. Oh my god, I'd kill you. Okay, well, I think... Hold on. Let me just uh, organize this real quick. Let me... I mean, let me... Okay. You are right next to it. You're here. Okay. Uh, I'm going to sleep for a sec. We're going to wake up at around four. We're going to launch out there and see what's up. Okay. Undock. Little doggy's still asleep. He's so cute. Okay. If he's in the middle, he can't get hurt. Right? Right? He can't get hurt. Put it in storage. I'm not going to put the dog in storage. He will die. He has to be fed. I have to give him constant fish. Guys, I know how to take care of a dog. Come on now. Okay, um, okay, okay. Uh, I'm gonna use my little guy, actually. Perfect. Is that where I'm supposed to be going? Hold on, I gotta look at my storage one more time. Do I have it marked in the right spot for the map? My storage. Okay. Right next to it, on the left corner. Oh, I don't have it marked correctly. So it's right here. I see. Okay, hold on. It's right here. Bam. Okay. Time to go, pirates. Undock. Everyone be singing sea shanties as I disembark. What are we naming the dog, by the way? It's gotta be a piratey name, right? We gotta do something piratey. Bang tooth? No, that's not what I'm looking for, right? That can't be what I'm looking for! I'm not looking for a fish, I'm looking for treasure. Right? Oh god, this does not feel correct. Does not feel good to be out on the open water with scary music. What's the bad music for? <gasps> what is this, chat? I think we found it. Lying just beneath the surface of the water is a floating chest held down by a chain that disappears into the deep. Well, that's easy. The chest is right there. Open it. Okay. Uh, amazing. We needed a research part. That's great. Big bag of doubloons. Oh, the refined metal is like $500. That's great news. Okay, we got a plate. Got a silver trinket. Okay, we got to be real careful right now. We have our pirate's treasure, everyone. Now, where to find a home for this dog? I truly do not know where to take this dog. Is there someone in particular that needs a dog? Hold on. Hold on. Pursuits. Find the dog a home. It's bound to be hungry. Okay, well... 
So I just could pick anywhere. Interesting. And I only have one more relic after this. Oh, God. Okay. Hmm. Well, I say let's just go to the nearest actual place that people could live. I say Ingfell. Ingfell maybe is a good bet. A good, a good, a good place to start, maybe, perhaps. I don't know. Let's turn around. Go this way. No one is any the wiser. This big crab look hungry for dog. You're evil. How dare you? How dare you? And you know what? I'm gonna grab some of these. I'm gonna just sell these real quick to uh Abyssal. Give me these abyssal piranhas. Fang teeth. Sorry, my bad. Very nice. Okay. I'm gonna be dropping these off. I get a little bit of money. Clear out the treasure that is in my pockets. So I only have the dog. I will... Sea Dog? Is that his name? We're naming the Sea Dog Sea Dog? I mean, it's kind of cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not the boat. Not the boat. Not the boat. Not the boat. God. Are real boats this hard to deal with? Like, this hard to turn around? Probably way worse. Okay, I'm gonna shove you in storage. You in storage. You, 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 you. Perfect. Now, this dog is sitting next to so many spooky piranhas. Sell all these fish. Do you want a dog? You don't want a dog. Okay, bye. Man. Finding a home for this dog is way harder than I thought. Okay, we're gonna go around this way. I'm not going to talk to that fucking crab. Evil fucking crab. Thank you very much. I know, I know scary music. I understand. I understand it's actually evil. Is there a way for me to, like, kill it or something? Because there's also a sell the dog. What is wrong with you? If I sold the dog to the fishmonger, she would probably just sell it to someone who wants to eat something. The little evil. Is there anyone else here that's alive? There's no one here. This poor abandoned dog. Oh, my book's done. Hold on. A plan for the future. Perfect. Past time to read. God, I'm really educating myself hard while I'm on on uh, route to... No. Remove. There we go. Back. En route to somewhere even better. En route to brighter locations. I don't know why all of a sudden I'm a southern pirate. It just makes sense. What are you? What are you? Oh, you know what? Sure. Why not? I could sell you guys at Ingfell. Loose jaw. No, I don't like that. Lock jaw. What are you? Loose jaw. I hate that, actually. I don't know why I hate that so much. But the name loose jaw makes me uncomfortable. It makes me feel like it would be swinging. I don't like that at all. Oh, I'm in the dark now. Well, good thing I have somewhere to stop. I'm so go <gasps> whoa oh it's that one again it's that guy again he's at wait he's here again he's here again hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on Whoop. cool yo yo with the pirate ship oh my god oh my god this is such a sick photo right now i'm obsessed with this camera feature i'm so glad we got it let me uh let me just Whoop. very nice goodbye before you eat me you scare me a lot where is... There? Oh god, I do not have as much time as I thought I did. I just found a key, and instead of looking for a lock, I wrote TARDIS on it and put it on my neck. God, I remember being there. And and it was a beautiful time, let me just tell you. I have a TARDIS blue ring that I got at Fanex that uh, says Time Lord on it, I believe. I'm, I'm pretty certain that it does. Can I just sleep here? Campsite. Oh, yeah, it has these runes. They're grouped together. Fresh footprints. Inspect the footprints. Whoever left the footprints was barefoot. They don't know much about footprints. Tread carefully around each symbol. Yeah, that's weird. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna sleep here in this creepy makeshift dock that is definitely haunted and someone 100% died in, right? I got two nose piercings about a week or so ago and the healing process sucks more than when I got my eyebrow pierced. I'm so sorry. Were they side nose piercings? What one were they here? Because when I got my septum pierced, it was pretty easy. Uh, but I want to get my eyebrow pierced so bad and I'm worried that it's gonna be a disaster. That it's gonna be super annoying. Whoa. Whoa, Nelly. Okay, where are we going? 
the lighthouse is honestly really helpful. Are they? I mean, it makes sense that they're that visible from that far away. That's their whole point, right? That's why lighthouses exist. I've never really been on the ocean. So I guess I didn't realize exactly how obvious it is. I like it, though. Think of how many people it saves. I could never work at a lighthouse, though. Oh my god, that's so scary. I, oh, ugh, all alone? No, absolutely not. That sounds so cool. I got a bracelet from Etsy with a, a Dalek and a TARDIS on it. That's so sick. Love. Doctor Who is such a great thing to be obsessed with. There is so much content. And it's fairly, like, not even just unproblematic, but, like, positive. Ingvel! Anyone want a dog? We got some lonely, sad people that are in these towns. Like, at least one of them needs a pet, right? 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 Like, someone's got to. Retired whaler, Ingfell resident. What is it? So you have a you have a dog already? Is that what's going on? I think you have a dog already, because my dog has red eyes. Where can I catch a conger eel? Oh, they can be tricky to find. I'm told they inhabit the holes and burrows within the cliffs themselves. I imagine they've been fished out around the edges, so you might have to venture into the passageways to find them. Did I mention they only come out at night? Good luck. Okay, well... That's not what I was wanting- Have you heard the tale of Magrin? He's an old whaler from these parts. I- I know- I know him. Yeah, I talk- I talked to him. People- He says a scroll told him how to become immortal by eating mutated fish? You mean the old whaler who gives me my bombs? eats mutated fish. One day, the town awoke to find all the boat's nets and lines has been slashed in the night. The old Magrin was nowhere to be found, nor has he been seen since. Oh, so that's not the guy I was thinking of. Okay, my bad. I was I was definitely thinking of a different person. Uh, okay. We catch our fish ourselves here, so we don't have much need for buying any. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, I'll, I'll go do that then. Well, that's awkward. You don't want a dog? Man, this poor dog, he's so cute. He doesn't deserve this. Okay, do I have whaling yards? Come for more packed explosives. Yeah, I guess. You're not the one that's crazy, right? 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 Okay, I'm gonna undock. Gonna go to you. I'm gonna sell my loose jaws. Get that the fuck away from me. Oh, this music is beautiful. This game is stunning. As much as I loved Inscription, and also Inscription is absolutely beautiful, uh, yeah, this game is, this game is so good. Episode 3 with Martha, oh, true, you're right, there's, well, and, uh, just the newest ones with the transit characters and everything are also great, I love it. Okay, these are stale, well, take them anyway, I, it took me a whole day to get here, what do you expect from me? Do I have, I have a research part, I'm gonna do some research real quick, I want this. I want this one. We just need one more chat, and we'll be able to the fathomless winch. Oh, it'll be so nice. Okay. Well, Ingfell is disappointing me, then. I guess... Man, I guess we just take the relic back, then. If I don't have anyone to take the dog, I'm not gonna give him to that hungry guy. We know that'll be a bad idea. Yo, 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 yo! Uh, boop! Allow me to just... Oh wait, what if I want you guys to come back out of the water? There! Yo! <laughs> I love cameras. Any any game with a camera that does this, we can like pause time. Obsessed. Love it. Love it so much. Come on out. Yeah. Oh, I want to see it. Pretty. Pretty. Wait, I want to get... Oh, the Greek cliffs in the background. Hold on. Whoop. Sorry, I'm having way too much fun with this. I got a sheet metal punch Dalek. Wait, that's sick. Punch Dalek? You mean you can punch him? Oh, is the baby out of the water? Sorry, this is Photographer Simulator now. You have to be okay with it. You have to. With my pirate ship. Yes! That's so fucking sick! That is so sick. What the fuck? Uh-oh. My game's frozen. Am I... I can't escape it, chat. 
I'm stuck. I I uh oh. Did I break it? Uh oh. Uh uh oh, chat. Uh oh. Did. Uh oh. Uh. The uh. Hmm. Hmm. Please don't tell me I have to quit my game. <laughs> I mean, it saved when I docked. Okay, so curse to take dolphin photos for life. I guess what we're learning is it cannot be Photographer Simulator. I'm so sad right now. Okay, well, uh, you didn't see this. It... You did. I'm gonna. I'm just. I... <sighs> If I had a harmonica right now, I'd be playing it. I'm inside a prison of my own mind. Ugh, oh, chat, you know what? Hold on. I have a pride flag outside, and I can see it whipping in the wind right now, which means that one of the things on it came undone. So I'm going to leave you guys with a very uncomfortable Super Mario theme in the void for a second, and I'll be right back, because I'm going to go fix it. It's driving me insane. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm back. I'm back. And there's an ad. Okay, well, we're gonna go back to this one, which, uh, Worm was very upset with me for. So I apologize. I- I'm sorry. To me, it made sense. Okay, clouds technically don't fly either. They just float. So, uh, if you're gonna be upset about that, I guess be upset about the entire thing. I'll take that. Here's the next one, though. Okay, I'll give you this next one. This one took me a minute. This one took me a second, and I'm trying to only give you guys riddles that I can solve <laughs> because I don't want it to be unfair. The more you take, the more you leave behind. What am I? This is difficult. This one took me a minute. So if you don't get it, if you do get it, I'll be impressed you get a Merc coin. If you don't get it, we'll, we're gonna come back to this. Don't worry. Breaths? Oh, interesting. So you technically do leave behind a breath. Interesting. You know what, Mint Choco Chi, you get an honorary big fucking brain badge today because you've been really out of the box with this. The answer that I found was the answer is in fact, German Potato steps. Good job, footsteps. The more you take, the more you leave behind. I, I, am very impressed with everyone here. Great job. And it was perfect timing with the end of that as well. I'm very impressed. Great job. Because that one took me a second. And you guys are all very big brain right now. I'm proud. I'm proud to call you mine. Truly. Okay, listen. Remember that uh, that didn't happen, but uh, I did have to get out of the game for a sec? Yeah. Um... Looks like the universe is giving me a second chance to not take photos of those dolphins. Um, I don't know why, 
don't know why they would possibly be wanting me to get that through my skull, but uh, I guess I'll do that fine. What is marked over here? What's the red mark over here? Is this the fish guy? Is this that fish guy? Wait, what does he want? Pursuits. Fish guy. Uh, find the dog a home. I'm not giving him the dog. Absolutely fucking not. No, wait. I No, no, no. I filled up the fish guy. Who was the fish guy? He was the guy that would sit there and ask me to feed him raw fish. You know, that guy. You know, just, just a guy who, you know, wanted to eat raw fish and did in front of me. But I actually, I satiated his hunger and then he gave me something weird and, and we're fine now. So, so it's all good. Oh, it was just this. It's just a pirate ship. Is this? This isn't the one, right? This isn't the fucking. Oh, I think this is the fucking crab chat. God damn it, I think this is the crab. Hold on. No, I've already been on this. Damn it, I've been to this wreck already. So it is. This is the fucking crab. Can I explode it? Can I just give it explosives? It is. This motherfucker. Check it out, chat. He's scary. He's cool. Wake up. Wake up. Yo! He's so spooky. How the fuck? What, do you do anything? Do you get mad at me, or you just, you just, okay, you're just territorial. God damn, that's cool. That is so cool. Okay, uh, yeah, I'll leave him here. I should have marked the other one. Whoops. Evil crab. My window's open because my room smells like nail polish. That is the worst. Anyone who understands, any, I mean, it's not just nail polish, but definitely that fits into the categories of, uh, events to do in your room that make it smell horrendous. Get, no, I can't do this. That make it smell horrendous, but you open the window in the middle of winter, and your options are either freeze or die. It's not a fun time. Same with dyeing your hair. Dude, it's a rough time. Dyeing your hair and, like, not having a good fan. And it's so cold. I want to be an evil crab in the middle of the sea when I grow up. I have not fully connected to the fact that I am a full adult, because I still say constantly, when I grow up, Holy fucking shit! Okay, no, I can't. I can't do this. I can't. I can't keep doing this, chat. I can't keep doing this. It's not even a good photo anymore. I just have to give it up. I have to let go. I have to let go. I can't let go. I can't let it go. I can't let it go. It, it could have the birth. It could just get the perfect shot, chat. It could be the perfect shot. Let me just. Let me just. Yes. That, very nice. Okay, no, I have to stop. God, give me a fucking warning next time, my guy. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna be honest, I think if I actually saw a whale breach in real life, I'd, like, shit my pants. Um, I think it would scare me so fucking bad. Especially if you're not there to see it, right? Like, people go on whale watching tours and whatnot, but imagine just being out in the ocean for any fucking reason and seeing that. I would shit myself. Oh my god, that's so scary. Oh my god. Hydration. Hydrate. To hydrate. Is the dog still in my... Oh, is he cold? Can I feed him? We should sleep. He's chilly. Okay, um... Oh, I have two crab pots up here by Devil's Spine. I am not... What the fuck was that sound? I am not going to leave this dog in Devil's Spine. Okay, I'm not insane. I'm not... I'm not evil. I'm, what would I give it to the crazy researcher guy over there? Absolutely not. Okay, where are we going? Um, I do want to go check on those crab pots. I'm gonna be so honest with you, but we'll save that for another time because I am keeping this dog away from danger, and I'm not gonna have any of you yelling at me saying that I put the dog in danger when I absolutely, positively did not. I 100% didn't. I'm so safe. Yeah, you finished your email. Woohoo! Productivity. Does anyone genuinely know what Beetlejuice is about? Because I can only listen to the, th the songs and from that I get nothing. Yes! 
Here you go. This is what Beetlejuice is about. Beetlejuice is about a house that's haunted and uh, about ghosts that can talk to other people. Beetlejuice is a ghost, or he's like a demon ghost creature guy from the underworld, from the dead, from the land of the dead, right? Where if you say his name three times, he likes to you summon him. And then, the, and then there's a girl and the, uh, Lydia, and she uh, she's depressed because her mom died, and her dad is like uh, moving on and trying to like not pay attention to the fact that her mom died, so that she's like really sad about it, and she's like, I'm gonna kill myself, and so she goes up to the top of the house. She's like about to jump off, and then Beetlejuice shows up, and he's like, Hey, no, 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 don't kill yourself actually uh just say my name three times and i'll do your bidding and i'll do whatever you want and i'll make your life like way better than it was before and i'll make your parents and like your make your dad pay for like treating you badly and she's like mm, i don't really fucking know if i want to do that bro and he's like look at these ghosts so look i can haunt these people that used to live here and she's like oh damn so ghosts just exist and he's like yeah and she's like well then i don't need you then i can use other ghosts and so then there's like a little thing that's like weirdly romantic even though he's like an 80 year old ghost like a, well i probably like more like 8,000, but he looks really old and he sounds really old although alex bregman's like really hot but then lydia's like a teenage girl so then, anyway, so then they ended up, like, a bunch of people get haunted, and then she's like, you know what, fuck these guys, I actually love ghosts, and then they ended up, they ended up getting married at the end. So that's Beetlejuice. It's it's pretty good, I'm gonna be honest. It's, it's a pretty good, it's, it's pretty good. I've never seen it on stage, though. I've just seen the movie, and then I've, I've listened to the musical. It's very good, though. It's good, so. Yeah. Yeah, I never know how to feel about that. If you're a musical theater fan, you know that there's a handful of shows that it's like, yeah, yeah we don't talk about the ending. The rest of it's okay, though. Um, Grease? Grease is one of those? Anyone fucking seen Grease? Because Grease is horrendous. Uh, it's good, and then it's not good. Then, then it's bad. Oh, hi, Envy! Hello, hello! Who gets married? Um... The demon and the teenage girl get married at the end. There's also a giant snake at one point. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Is this a new one? It's a new. The once strong wooden hull lays broken against the shoreline. The stern is completely beached. Try to get inside. You pull a bit closer and manage to clamber into the back of the wreck you look around excuse me little doggo i'm gonna put this cloth by your head so you can rest little baby boy okay maybe someone in little marrow wants a dog i don't know i'm not giving him to the fishmonger that's for sure he would eat him he will a hundred percent eat him Ooh, what are these sharks can i catch you i don't have an oceanic thing fuck okay that's fine that's okay I don't need it anyway. I need one more research part. One. One more. And then we're there. Chat, this warhead has been staring at me for days. I want to take it. No. I can't. I won't. I shan't. I shan't. It's like Heathers, but it's just completely fucked. Well, Heathers is also a little bit completely fucked. Hmm. I haven't seen that strange red light in a while. I wonder what it was. Why did I go straight to you? I don't want you. Uh, Lighthouse Keeper, do you want a dog? No, you don't want a dog. Okay. Uh, Builder, hey. What do you want? Wait, you wanted something? Bring two units of lumber and two units of scrap to Steel Point. Oh. Oh! I was do- I was doing that for you. I better get on that. I really should. Hey, Mayor. You don't want a dog, right? No, no. Yeah, you should get- Okay, I should leave then. You guys are all really fucking weird. I'm gonna be honest. I'm just gonna go. My creepy old guy- I made my parents watch the movie with you. Wait, wait, uh... Heathers? <laughs> you made your parents watch Heathers with you? Oh my god. Just don't make them watch Saltburn with you. Anyone who watched Saltburn with their parents, that's actually, like, the craziest thing I think anyone could ever go through with their family. Oh my god, I'm praying for you. Oh my god, that's actually insane. Okay, I'm gonna move you over here. I'm just gonna fill up on crabs. I'm just gonna fill the fuck up on crabs. Also, chat, my pride flag is not staying down. Um, but I'm just gonna choose to ignore it, okay? My OCD is being mad at me and being like, hey, no, we should go deal with that right now. No. I'm okay, actually. Nothing's gonna happen to it. And we're chillin', and I'll go fix it later.
I don't even know where the fucking hammer and nails are, bro. Grieving father! Perfect, bro. Uh, do you... W I did make them watch Saltburn. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, you refuse to watch Saltburn? Saltburn is so good. Just don't watch it with your family. Uh, at all. Merc, have you seen Society of the Snow? Is that... Hunger Games? Or am I completely wrong? I have not seen it. I have not seen it. Saltburn was good. Merc, you should talk about Saltburn. Listen, all I'm going to say about Saltburn is that the main character is Trans Mask. And, and queer coding, okay, queer coding exists to code queer characters when they cannot be explicitly queer on screen. And yes, his character's already queer, but he's not explicitly trans because the world is not ready for an explicitly trans character, okay? So he's queer coded. He is trans mask coded. Heavily, heavily, 100% on purpose. There is a comment about him passing as a real human boy. That was all it fucking took for me, but there's more than just that, okay? All I'm saying is, if anyone ever tries to argue that he's not trans mass coded, just point them in my direction. I will, I will have a conversation. I will have a conversation. It's a Spanish movie based on a plane crash in the 1970s. I have not. Can you message me that on Discord? Because I want to watch it. I refuse to watch it because so many people have told me not to watch it, so I was scared. Here's the thing. You have to remember, because I also, I had the same experience on TikTok. People were like, oh my god, I, I had to leave the theater during Saltburn. I literally threw up. It was so crazy. Are the people that watch only solely Marvel movies. I'm sorry I said what I said. Like, if you don't watch... If you don't watch, like, normal movies, or only watch, like, blockbuster movies, like, if you don't watch, like, art movies... Then yeah, Saltburn's gonna make you feel so overwhelmed. It's a beautiful movie. Saltburn is a beautiful movie. Extremely well written. There is a lot of sexual content. It's a very R-rated movie, but it is an incredibly well written movie. And extremely queer. Um, so that's what I'm gonna say. That's all that I was gonna say. Saltburn is just like barely a Okay, correct. Also, I will say it felt heavily like I was watching a really good adaptation of a fan fiction and and that's not a negative thing <laughs> like i'm not being negative about that at all hello grieving father no i can't give you the dog okay dock worker do you oh i think i'm gonna give him the dog the dock worker is standing motionless on the edge of the dock oh oh no chad i don't think the dock worker wants the dog I think we gave him a package, and it's finally caught up to him. Um, the dock worker is standing motionless on the edge of the dock, staring down at the water. He seems paralyzed by fear at what he sees. What's wrong? He stares ahead in silence. You stand with him for a while. Occasionally, a tremor shakes his body and his breathing becomes labored. Are you alright? He seems unable to respond. He strains, clenching his fists, eyes shut tight with effort. A tear rolls down his cheek. Oh god, did I make a fucking zombie? What happened? You notice his neck and overalls are covered in a dark fluid. The same dark fluid that was leaking from the package you delivered earlier. His body suddenly relaxes and his eyes snap open again. They're cloudy and expressionless. Fluid rattles through his lungs. Ugh. A drop of dark ooze falls from one of his ears and lands on the dock. It slips between the boards and disappears into the water below. What was that? A trembling head turns ever so slightly towards you. His breathing grows heavy in anger until you step backwards, leaving him standing there on the dock. Um... That's extremely bad. Okay, awesome. So you're not getting the dog. I'm, in fact, I'm taking, I'm rescinding your ability to have this dog. I'm going to take that away from you now. I'm going to move some of this shit. Oh, I'm so bad at organizing. Hold on. There. There! I love Tetris. Okay, we're good now. We're fine now. Gucci! We're Gucci. All Gucci to Moochie. Okay. And I'm going to put you there. Perfect. Return to town. Did you see Has Been yet? I have not seen all of it. 
I saw like the first three episodes when I was uh, hanging out with someone else and so we were kind of talking the whole time, but I was really loving it. So then I watched back like three or four episodes and then I fell asleep. So I've double seen the first half of it, <laughs> but I never finished it. I've spent the time to finish it, but I haven't. Okay, hold on. Because uh, like what I was saying earlier with my fun brain times that I've been having recently, Okay, I can sell all my fish, and I will keep my dog. Thank God. Okay. Um, I've been watching a lot of shows. Haven't been able to do much other than that. But, I have been- Oh my God! Hold on, chat! I made something. First of all, check out my shirt. It's not my shirt, it's Bunny's shirt. But it's sick, right? That's fucking sick, dude. That is so cool. But guys- you know my bug shirt, right? You guys remember my bug shirt? Hold on. Hold on. Hold fucking hold the phone. Hold the fucking phone. God, I am sick. Okay. You guys remember this? My butte. This beautiful, beautiful shirt. If you didn't, just know I'm going to make a lot more of these. Um, one thing that I've been doing as I've been a little bit depressy is making art that's not on my computer. And so I went back to these and I realized I want to make a full collection of these shirts. Um, I'm also, I can't make them reflective, but I am going to make a rainbow version. I'm going to scan these in and I'm going to make a print version of these in uh, rainbow colors. Unfortunately, they can't be this holographic, but if you do want to commission me for an actual holographic one, I can do that as well. It'll just be more expensive because I have to like physically make it myself and then send it out and whatnot. But I'm going to be making this merch, okay? And it's, fu it's not just fucking this, okay? This is my official announcement. I'm going to be making a trippy critter collection that is going to be so cool. It is going to be separate. Like, it's going to be on my merch site, hopefully. Um, but this is going to just... It's going to be like this, where it's going to have a funky rainbow critter on each one. And I've made a second one, and I want to share it with you guys because I'm very proud of it, okay? So here's, here's my first draft, bug number one. And as of yesterday, I finished bug number two. Which is so beautiful. I'm extremely proud of this one. It has two different colors on its wings. It makes it double awesome. I fucking love it. Uh, so yeah, I really, 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 really like these a lot. And I'm going to be making more. They're fun, right? It's pretty cool. I already have designs for a ladybug, a moth, a snail and a bat, I think, although I'm not sure about that. What other bugs would you guys like to see? What other critters would you like to see? Give me your favorite critters in the comments because I will take any and all inspiration. I'm gonna be working on a third shirt after stream today, so. If you guys want uh, other designs, I will be making all of them into merch designs that can be uh, got on my site, so. I can't make holographic printing on the t-shirts. There's like, there's not a way for me to do that. Um, however, however, I am going to be trying to figure out how to make holographic stickers. So I'm going to be trying to turn all of them also into stickers that are holographic in the same places as all of them, which I think will be really, really cool. And I'm going to start trying to make, um, like actually make a bunch of those shirts so that you can commission an actual holographic one that's handmade, which is fun. Uh, they're just going to be more expensive because it does take a lot of my time, but I fucking love it. They're so fun. Yes, the moth is so cute, you guys. Oh, I think, I don't think it's up here. Yeah, I think my, my backpack's somewhere else, but you guys will see them. You guys will see them eventually. Anyway, sorry, thanks for letting me talk about that for a second. You can get a moth. Um, the moth is on a light bulb because they're all tripped out, right? They're all trippy. So the moth that I have, I think I have a picture of it on my phone. Hold on. You get to see 
the smallest doodle of it, chat. Because it's so cute. It's so cute. Okay, well, let's see if it'll... Look at him! Dude, it's gonna be fucking adorable! Oh my god! That was just the doodle I did yesterday. I, I'm obsessed. I think they're so cute. I wanna get- I want a bunch more. I also wanna figure out a way to do a praying mantis. But their shapes are hard. Their shapes are difficult. I don't know how to do that. Okay. Maybe Blackstone? Maybe the dog can go with the relic guy? I don't really trust him though. I don't feel like that's a great idea. I feel like he's gonna do experiments on the fucking dog. Yeah, he's a cutie patootie! Okay, I'm so glad that you guys like it. I've been talking about wanting to be working on other merch stuff for a really long time, and I've been coming up with this idea, but I have not been able to sit down and physically create art, and now that I'm in the flow of it, I'm really, really liking it, and I want to finish all the designs and turn them digital and get them onto actual merch as soon as possible. So, I think it'd be really fun. Um, thanks for let me chat about that for a sec. Alright, fine! I don't trust this guy, okay? I will start off right now. Oh, sorry. Every time I move him, he barks at me. I'm gonna start this off by saying I don't trust this motherfucker one bit. One bit. One bit. I also have to blow my nose. Hold on. We out here. We sick as fuck. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, sorry. You walk in and place the jewel-encrusted ring on a table by the collector. His eyes widen. We're certainly making excellent progress now. And I know what you're thinking. That I get another magic power? Hmm? An item like this would fetch a fortune at any auction. But for us, its value transcends material wealth. Regardless, you're due a reward. Once more, he opens the book. Dust pouring from the pages as he reads aloud. You begin to feel weak. You're rooted to the spot. Knees on the verge of buckling. Atrophy. Instantly harvest an entire shoal of fish? Holy shit. As he finishes speaking, you feel blood rushing back to your legs. A strange feeling of power grows in your chest. We're so close. One more remains. I loathe to suggest it, but the abyssal plane on the approach to Devil's Spine is a likely candidate. See what you can find. I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? Hmm. Are you human? That's a normal question, right? Hercules beetles. That's sick. Okay, I want to write down a beetle. Sick. Thank you. Cool. Love it. Your inquiry is met with a piercing gaze. Why, of course. As human as you are. Anything else? Mm, well, no one's saying I'm human, so... I don't know. I don't know how to feel about that. It's locked. Okay, I still don't have a way to get in there. Okay. Where do I take the dog? Chat, I just want a safe home for this dog. I wasn't expecting to have this mission. I didn't expect to get this dog. I... I... Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna... I'm gonna sleep. I'm gonna sleep so fast and check on that fucking dock worker. And then we're gonna have to go... I guess... I have fuck, man. I don't know. I don't want to give him to... What? The researcher? Maybe the researcher. The researcher said she had to flee, right? I I guess maybe that is where I'm supposed to go. Oh, the builder. Kind of forgot I had a duty for, like, the things that I said I was going to do, you know? Steel point? Yeah, I should probably go do that. Okay, I'm going to go, like, drop those off so quick. Because I definitely have what she needs, I think. Let me make sure I don't fucking die real quick. Okay, we're fine. We're all good. Oh. We are not all good. We're not all good. Uh, a loud horn, make your presence known. What does it do? What will it do? Oh, shit. That's so scary. Never mind. Never mind. Bad. Bad times. Yeah, you can't come in this way. 
What happens? I want you to come. I want to see it. I want to see what you do. Can you come in any farther? You can't. Interesting. Well, I fucked up, so I'm gonna hide now, because I'm very scared. That That is not something I should have done. Uh, don't lose the dog. You're right! I see, I should be a lot safer right now. We've got the dog, and he's sleeping. He's so eepy right now, we should not be honking this horn. Okay, I'm gonna sleep for, like, a teensy bit longer. Okay! So, everything's gone now. Is there any way to, like, kill them at all? I don't think so. I think I just run. That makes me mad. I want to fight him. I want to fight him. Okay, we're going, we're going. And safely, too, I'm not going to blow out an engine because that could affect the dog, which would be so sad. Uh, I actually can't, I won't be able to handle that. I think if the dog dies, we just restart. I think everyone agrees if the dog dies, we go back to whatever save where he did not fucking die and nothing happened, okay? Because nothing's ever going to happen to this dog, ever. Ever. I'm not crying. You are crying. There's something in my eye. I don't know what you're saying. Material pile. Is the island where the... I uh, want... Oh, man. I need them in my fucking inventory? I... Well, okay. Hold on. My guy. What if I take the dog to the... The guy in the... Twisted Strands? Just throwing this out here. Just throwing it out here. What if we just try it out? Hey, maybe, you know, character development and whatnot, everything happens for a reason. <gasps> Yo, I want a peanut butter chocolate chip cookie. What the fuck? I'm hungry now. Is that one of those like Reese's cookies? Oh my God, those are so good. Thank you for sharing. God, there actually is something about our chat. <laughs> It's because I made the mistake that any contact wearer knows. I took a nap in my contacts. I've been getting really tired at like 10 a.m. Um, because I can't sleep in. I think what it is is that I should be sleeping until like 9. But my body wakes up at 6 or 7 and then I'm just here. And then I get really exhausted a couple hours later. <laughs> I'm like, well, yeah. Maybe I should have just kept on sleeping. Do I have anything? I do not. Okay. I'll put that. I'll put the net down. Why not? No. Oh, not the crab net. The troll net. Yeah. Why not? Um. Okay. I have to be so careful because we know how I do in here. We know that I'm great at navigating in here. I'm phenomenal, actually. And anyone who says differently is fucking wrong. Can I get anything from this anymore? Or is it just a mangled mess of wood and wire? Yeah. Okay. That's it. All right. Bye-bye. Yup. Old news. We've been here. Storage the dog. I don't want to put the dog in storage. That feels so wrong. And things die. I don't trust it. It's not safe. Yup. Yup. Knock, knock. Knock, knock. Oh, there's an ad. Oh, sorry. It's safer there. I don't trust you. I can never get that back. And I can't unsave that. That's the biggest problem. I can't unsave it. Hi, chat. There's an ad break. Hold the fuck on. Hold the fuck on. This is a very important moment, chat, that I am too distracted to do. There. <laughs> I'm very organized. I'm so tired right now. Listen. I don't know why I feel like an angry substitute teacher right now. I have something in my eye. Yeah, a contact. I'm gonna... Do you wanna give me attitude right now? I'll call your parents. Don't fucking test me. Have you ever had a substitute teacher swear at you? Oh my god, mustache reveal. Chat, it's getting real fucking dark. I'll tell you. It filled in for some reason. There was like another line that got added the other day or something because I went to go visit Bunny at work and Bunny and uh, my other friend on two separate occasions on the same day were like, your mustache looks so dark. What the fuck? And I was like, I just, it just grows. I'm just here, man. So yeah, just chilling, just chilling. There you go. Okay, never mind. So the, uh, <laughs> the dirt strip caterpillar mustache is back. Uh, the subs today 
got a special mustache reveal. That was what you got for that ad break. I hope you feel very grateful. Airman, how are things going? Okay, you don't want it either. Well, where the fuck do I go for this dog? I feel so bad for this dog. Do I storage him, chat? I don't feel like that's correct. That doesn't feel good. No. I stress. I stress. Where does it go? He has one arm and a knife. Don't give the dog to him. You're correct. He barely has enough food for himself. I, I don't trust him for the dog. I just want to check all my bases. Where else would it be? We've moved that guy back with his brother, right? So he's not alone. I'm trying to figure out anyone who'd be, like, lonely. I guess the researcher is the best option, huh? Ooh, it's nighttime. I don't like that. I don't have a mangrove thing, so I can't even... What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? The fuck was that? Don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like it. I don't like that. Don't do that. I don't like it. Don't- I don't do that. I don't like that. What's over here? Oh, I need to turn around right now. I need to turn around right now while the sun is still here. I'm stupid. I'm a dummy. I've got a dog in the boat. I can't- I'm- I'm feeding for two now. Okay? I can't act rashly. Not like I have been. I can't be silly. Not like I have been. No more. No more chat. Okay, can you just take this fish? Yeah, yeah, can you take this? Just, I don't... Can you just take the game mullet, please? Just take it from me, thank you. Okay, goodbye. I don't want to talk to you right now. I'm mad. I'm upset. I've got a dog to take care of. I've got things to do. There was a thing over here and it was sparkly. I see it. There's two. Lore, chat, lore! Holy shit, there's lore! Okay, hold on. Messages and bottles. I see them coming my way. I'm safe. We're all safe and good and sound. We're safe and sound. Oh. It's the dog tags. I think that's what it is. I don't know. Wait. Is that what it is? I think so. Dog tags. We'll put that next to the dog. Don't eat those. Okay? Don't eat them. Can I get anything out of this? No. That was just the... It was just the sign that that's where someone perished. I see. I see. I see. Oh. Oh! I think we've been here, chat. Isn't that my ship? Isn't that the ship that looks like mine? Pretty sure I've, I've seen this. I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly, this is the- That's awesome. We needed that. Okay, I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly. This boat looks- uh, Oh, no. This is not the- <gasps> Fuck! Jesus. Okay, well, hold on! This bitch. This bitch. This bitch. I'm gonna be... No, I can't blow it up. God, that's so annoying. Oh, you're so annoying. I forgot you existed. Shut the fuck up. No one cares about you. Sorry, I'm really aggressive right now. This is what happens when I don't sleep, I guess. Is this a flag? I think this is a flag. Am I gonna get the flag of his ship? Hook flag. Okay, sick. It's also cool. It's a, it's a bit of a dredge, you know, a bit of a dredger. Oh, damn, that's just fully another plane. Rest in peace to that guy. Well, now I have to go back and give him his dog tags. Fine, I'll do it. I'm gonna go so fast, so speedy fast, you don't even fucking know. I'm hungry, but my day is almost over. Help, listen to your body. That is a very important piece of information I will give to anyone. Listen to your body. If you're hungry, eat. If you're hungry, eat. I'm hungry right now. I should probably get food. But I'll do it after stream. Because I'm just feeling the tips of the toes of... <gasps> oh my fucking god! Um... I can't save it, right? I... I mean, like, I can't... I just go over it, yeah. That's terrifying. Cool. Love it, 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 
Love it. I love seeing things under the water. It doesn't make my skin crawl. I don't feel sick to my stomach right now. Great. I needed more of those. That's awesome. I'll take as many as I can get. Thank you. It's becoming evening time, but that's okay. We killed all the monsters in here. Yeah, that's one way to feel safe. I feel fine. I killed everything here. I'm not the monster, right? I'm not the one I should be worried about. That's, that's crazy. That's way too much critical thought. Okay. Sorry, sir. I was just dredging through the depths for your friend's remains and also the remains of their ship. Uh, okay, here you are. Good. I know exactly... I can't... I can't do it, can I? Oh, I can! There's something weird here. Give me the weird one. Give me the weird... Not the normal game, Mullet. Give me the weird one! Damn it. Give me the weird one. Gleaming Mullet. Oh, you're awful. Thank you. Oh, I'm so glad I got you. You're horrendous. Okay, we're gonna turn on my lights. Gleaming mullet, the gayest of all gays, I see. All right, let me launch through here. Wait, am I going the wrong way? God damn it, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, I forgot the vines change at night. I got the dog. Got a dog. I have to be careful. I've got a dog. Got a dog. I cannot be dangerous right now. Safety first. Safety first. I'm focused. I'm focused. I'm focusing. I'm focused. Hey, dude, I've got something for you. You're going to be real happy about it, I think. Maybe. Perhaps? I have a feeling. I have a feeling you're going to love it. Careful, SpongeBob! Careful, SpongeBob! Oh, how are things going? I found some dog tags. Let me see. Just just the two. Just the two. Mm. I... Thank you. I'll hang them on the tree. Here, as promised. Ow. I'm, it's really overkill with these. Uh, well, that's everything. I'm going to just really fast. I'm just going to finish this. Sweet. I'm also just get. Yes. Yes. We did it, chat. It was perfect. It's just as God intended. Okay, we're gonna sleep. Okay, now we're awake. I, I, oh, fuck. I left my lights on all night. <laughs> That's not great. Okay, perfect. Grand. Oh my God. The worst part of having a cold, and maybe this is just me, okay, maybe I'm crazy, um, is that my ears feel weird. My ears feel like they're constantly popping, and I don't like it. It's like, oh, it is so uncomfortable. Or like, it, not like they're popping, it feels like I got out of the shower. You know? Ugh. It bugs. It bugs. Hydration check. Chat, I can't take the dog to Devil's Spine. I've basically given this dog a tour of the entire ocean. I have a feeling it's probably just going to be the researcher. I have a guess that is where I'm supposed to be going. I'll just go back to the researcher. If she eats the dog, she eats the dog, I guess. Chat, I have to do my dishes. Everyone behave for a minute while I'm gone, okay? Hey, I'm so proud of you for doing your dishes. Good on you. That's difficult. That is truly a difficult task. No, I don't need another mullet. I don't need that. I want to zoom. Okay, let me zoom. Good. Please, I need a safe place for this dog. If anything, I guess just a place for us to hang our hat for the night, but... Is is there truly nothing more? What is, it? What is this? Have I been here? What is that? Is that another plane? Jesus, how bad of pilots were you guys? How many are there? Oh my god. It is another plane. Or is this a fucking crab? I think it's a fucking crab, chat! How dare you! No! You fucking suck! Bruh! What is it with the crabs in this area? Everyone hopefully agrees with me now at this point that crabs fucking suck, okay? Everyone should agree with me. Shut up! At this point, we can all agree they're awful. The only good crab I've ever met was a crab named Casper from my friend Kate. And that's the only nice crab, the only crab I've ever seen that I will tolerate. He's cute too. He's orange and purple. He's a Halloween crab. It's really cute. Can I advocate for naming the dog Triton? Honestly, yeah. King of the sea. That's fucking sick. He deserves it. He's been through so much. Oh. 
Oh, my net's broken. My net needs repair. Well, we got a lot of fish. Hey, I'll take them. I'll take them. No, I need to stop. I need to stop overfilling the boat because then we're gonna crash and the dog's gonna fucking die. It's okay. The researcher's right here. Maybe the photographer, if the researcher doesn't take it. You know, I need to take a breath. I think if the researcher doesn't take it, I need to consider the possibility of the storage room. Chad, I don't know if that's Death Wish. I don't know if that's the worst decision. Name of a moon of Neptune? Oh, that's cool. I mean, that makes sense, since all the planets and all gods are connected. Just sick. I should learn more about Roman stuff. Uh, researcher! Oh, hello again. What do you need? Yes! This dog needs a home. Do you want it? A dog? Oh, gosh. Let me see. The dog bounds over to the researcher. She crouches down to pet the dog, grinning. The dog licks her chin in response. I could de definitely- uh, No. No. I will not. I've made it almost all stream. I could definitely take this one off your hands. And I'd love the company. Are you sure? Oh, I could keep the dog. <laughs> but I know. He's better off with you. No, it's okay. Take him. Go. Don't look at me like that. No, you should take the dog. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Just go! No, we didn't bond. He was asleep the whole time. I never- I didn't pat his head gently. I didn't think of a name for him. I didn't- you know. <laughs> No, it's okay. It's all good. It's all good. Yes, thank you. Oh, we're gonna be such good friends. He can be my assistant. I'm so happy for you. Suddenly, the dog stands- Oh, no. Suddenly, the dog stands upright and begins to retch, its stomach heaving. Seconds later, it vomits a wet glob onto the floor. Something glistens through the mucus. Oh, um, that's... interesting. I suppose that's yours, if you want it. Sure. You know, I'll take... I'll take whatever. I can clean the rest up, don't worry about it. Okay. Well... Okay, I'm gonna just shove those over there then. Shove that over there, shove that over there. Oh, I can fit all of you actually. Hold on. Yuck! Well, that was quite eventful. Um. I'm gonna undock real quick. I'm gonna use the last little bit of daylight to get to the fishmonger. Where are you, lady? Oh, Jesus Christ. Hold on. And the old, uh, I really overestimate the amount of time I have between anything. Honestly, I don't understand. I need infinitely faster engines in order to be succeeding at what I think I'm succeeding. I'm racing the sun! Please! Hold on! Hold on! I need you. I'm in a race still. Trust me, I'm still racing. I'm totally racing right now. I'm racing. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Hold on! Hold on! I'm racing you! I see. I see her. I'm safe. I'm good. I'm good. We got it in time, Chad. Everything's good. Oh. Another magical creature, you say? Gimme it. Gimme it. Gimme it. Gimme it. Is it the tooth one again? We start and end with a tooth guy? Tooth firefly? Tooth squid guy? A tooth in your eye? Many in your- oh, no. Come on. Don't be shy. Come out and fly. Like the, like the squiddy guy that you want to, oh, come on, where are you? Radiant squid. Holy shit, that's cool. Whoa. A beacon from the depths below, a glimpse of a new sky. I don't know how to feel about that one. Oh, please get me there before 24. Get me there before 24. I think my fish are not going to be stale. Just kidding. That is rotting. Okay, hold on. Well, that's... Okay. These are fresh, though. We kept them in the water, so that's good. They're fresh. And that is so scary. I kind of love that one. Damn it. That one's rotting, too. Okay. Damn, damn, damn. I... Oh. It said, fucking where, bro? Fucking where? Where do you expect me to put this? Hmm. 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 
Well, I guess I can get rid of this now, huh? I guess I can discard the map now. I'll discard the map. It was a good time. Thanks for the trash. Thanks for the trashes. But, uh, we good now. Dude, this squid is so cool. Look at it. It's funky. Oh, I hate it. It, it's, it bobbles. What the fuck? Woo, woo, woo. Okay. Fine. Take the creepy fish. I didn't want it anyway. That's fine. Okay, Chad. Holy cow. That was an experience. I say next time. He said that this. Oh, there it is. No, not there. Where was it? He said the abyssal depths around here. Is it here? He said he marked a place for me to get. Did I already get the watch and just fucking lose it? Is that what happened? I think that might have been what fucking happened. Oh. Uh, okay. Other lore stuff. I don't want to get into that right now. I can't get into that right now. I need a pursuit. Search for relics. Find the watch in Devil's Spine. Oh, it is in Devil's Spine. Okay. Well then, Chad, I think the next step is Devil's Spine. Oh, also, Bunny said hi. I forgot to tell you guys at the beginning of the stream, Bunny said hi. I'm kind of awful for that. I can't believe I forgot to tell you the most important thing about stream today. I hope you can forgive me. Um, but I think I'm going to play Dredge again tomorrow. And Bunny might be here. Which would also be fun. Um, so thank you so much for joining me. This is a very fun stream. I'm hungry. So I'm going to go eat. If you're hungry, you should also go eat. Even if it is a midnight snack. Even if it's two in the morning. Hopefully it's not two in the morning for anyone. Um, yeah, thank you guys for being so patient with me. I appreciate your, um, constant support, even when I don't show up when I say I will. It's like my worst quality. I'm sorry that I can't always follow through with what I say, um, due to my body and mind not really being tip-top shape all the time. But know that you make me feel so much better. And I hope that I can make you guys feel a little bit better as well. I love streaming. It always makes me feel good. Uh, I hope that you enjoy them and that you'll come back tomorrow. I appreciate you so much. Y'all have a great time zone. <laughs> um, yeah, what can I say? I was gonna say I'm superior, but I don't even like making jokes about America being superior anymore because it's fucking not. So, oops. Is there anyone you guys wanna raid? Uh, I have not been raiding, but I really feel like I should be raiding. Let me glance, let me glance, let me glance. Who do we see? Who do we see? Oh, I see, I see one. I'll just send you guys over here. Hold on, whoop. Everyone, hold up. If you uh, can't stay for the whole stream, just stay for the raid, just because it looks nice and everyone loves a little bit of a raid. Um, so, there you go. Everyone enjoy. Have a great one. I'll see y'all tomorrow, okay? Spread the love. If you're gonna go to sleep, go to sleep gently and kindly and softly in your soul. I don't know what I'm talking about right now. I'm gonna go eat and go to sleep. And, oh, and make another shirt. I'm excited about that. Bye, y'all. See you later. Woo! Ba-da, ba-da-da-da-da-da.